worked in Boston and uh, doing a movie and uh, I was inspired to visit the Boston Museum and uh, we saw the great John Compley painting of Paul Revere. And we sang this on the uh, Capitol lawn last 4th of July. And we realized we were playing here in Boston with the Boston Pops and we thought this was a great opportunity to come here to this historic site and sing this song. And it's a story of Paul Revere's ride uh, with facts taken from uh, the great book of Paul Revere's Ride by David Hackett Fisher. And um, it's the title of the song is Me and Paul Revere. And you're saying, well, who's the me? Uh, the me is Paul Revere's horse. <laughs> it's sung from the point of view of Paul Revere's horse, because a lot of people think they know about Paul Revere's ride, but it's actually more complicated than the traditional story you hear. And this song also tells a story of what happened to Paul Revere's horse that night, because nobody really knows about that except me and David Hackett Fisher. <laughs> so this song is called Me and Paul Revere. It's sung by my, uh, the Steep Canyon Rangers, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> catch the lyrics the first time because we're going to do it twice. <laughs> we got some video people. Are you from the news? Yeah, Channel 7. Woo, we made the news! <laughs> <laughs> we made more news than Paul Revere. <laughs> Two more people. Okay. We'll kick it off. Here it goes. <laughs>
told them what to do. But they let him go, but sadly, so they took me with them too. And I never saw Revere again. I know he thinks of me. Wonders where I ended up the night we set me free. And I'm just a horse that no one knows. I'm famous though inside, standing proudly in a field.